And welcome back to the nominations where it's that time we've all been waiting for, the fourth annual Impy Awards. Let's head down to Mount Denkins where the party is just getting started. And now please welcome to the stage your hosts, the infallible Tom Dent and the bleached assassin, Jen Simpkins. Hello! Hello. <laughs> that was amazing, we appeared out of thin air. Magical, almost like magic. Hello and welcome, welcome, welcome to the fourth annual MP Awards! Fourth. Oh my goodness. The welcome fourth. Jen. Welcome Tom. Thank you very much, how are you? I'm Good, actually. Good. I'm, I'm feeling pretty happy. Yeah. Very gold, very lovely. Oh, and you're very dress. purple. Thank very, you very, very much. Very dreams purple. Thank you, thank say. you. Wonderful. So happy to be here, live, in the nominations. And we really are live. We are. Well, we... The, you know, the haters have been saying this week that perhaps we might not be live. We're live. Is tap back? Tap back. We, that's, how we, that's how we're proving. We know that we, you, we're waiting for you. We know. We're not going to get things started. We're in the chat. We can't see, we can't <laughs> see the chat, so we're just hoping that you're back. Well, I, when we were talking about proving we were live, I was like, oh, I'll pinch myself. That's not going to prove anything, no, is it? No, it really is not. Like, that's it how really you prove not. that you're not dreaming. It, well, like, well, well, there. Well, we're live. We're live. We're we live. know we're live. Well, welcome. Welcome to this wonderful, wonderful nominations. That the nominations. We've been exploring, actually, for the past week. Uh, you know, having interviews with creators, talking to some of our molecules, moving around between the islands. We gave a hint about a long climb ago. We did, we did. We'll have we had more details our next week. wonderful curation team uh, yeah. take on an obstacle challenge for, yeah. uh, I think, about 11 straight minutes. It was wonderful. Well done. Um, so, yeah, we've been, been hyping up for the MPs, and now we're here. The day has arrived. It's Sunday. Sunday. Sunday, 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 Sunday. <laughs> and what will we be doing today, Tom? We are going to be holding a fantastic celebration of all you guys and, and everyone that spends time in the dream of us, the past 12 months, everything that's been going on and uh, giving out a bunch of uh, awards. Yes. Oh, from, from audio design to sculpture to community star, we've got all sorts of awards that we're going to be handing out to people in the dreams community who have just... Rocked our worlds this year with uh, wonderful, wonderful, creative and uh, beautiful things in the dream of us. Uh, so, yeah, thank you so much for joining us. Thank you for being here. Hope everyone's well. Yes, we hope you're all well. Uh, and, yeah, I mean, I would love to talk a little bit more about the nominations where mm. we are. I know you've been kind of seeing them throughout the week, uh, but we actually uh, we found some archive footage Yes. actually, uh, here uh, at Nominations H HQ that should uh, help give a little bit of background to the culture and the history of the nominations. So can we, can we see this archive footage, please? Our glorious nominations, or as they used to be referred to as, our glorious nomination. For the trail of islands that we held so dear were once one complete landmass. This landmass sat atop the prolific ocean. Let's hear it for the citizens of our great nation, taking good care of the environment and taking good care of each other. That's right, friend, you too. And of course, the annual accolades of the Dream of Us, the MP Awards, are highly revered and celebrated among the nominations populace. However, Disaster was in store for our people as a cataclysmic event split the landmass into many islands. Widely believed to be the fault of a gigantic enemy crab living in a prolific ocean, this event came to be referred to as the Crabaclism. With our beloved landmass split apart, rich veins of valuable resource were revealed. The Kelstone. With our people divided and in need of salvation, who can harness the anti-gravitational potential of these mysterious marvels? Who can save us from the beast below? Who can save our impy celebrations? 
Well, how about that? Whoa, that was fascinating. There's a rich and storied history of totally. the Norman nations. Totally, wow. All sorts going on yeah. around these places. And just wonderful to be here. And uh, actually, I would like to extend a, uh, a gratitude and thank you to our sponsors for this event, Nomcom, mm. uh, here in the nominations, uh, revered entity. Uh, thank you so much for making this show possible, Nomcom. Um, yes, so on with the awards. Yes, I and we have 23 kangaroos to get through. Mm -hmm. uh, I first want to do a big shout out to our community members over at PAX. Hi. I think they're watching with us live. <laughs> Hello, everybody. Everyone that's watching us around the world. Hope you're very well. Hope you're going to enjoy the show. We have 23 kangaroos to mm -hmm. get through, mm -hmm. which is a lot for just the two of us. There's only one yes. me and one you. Yes, I, I think we could really do with some help. Uh, and so actually, Nomcom have been kind enough to supply us uh, with, uh, with some help uh, that should uh, you know, ensure that we have a smooth impies experience. So uh, let's introduce them now. Shutter, where are you? Where are you? Oh, there they are. Uh, hello, hello, hello. <laughs> this is Shutter, everybody. Everyone say hello, Shutter. Say hello. That is an H, H, S, A, I can't spell Shutter. <laughs> S H U T dash R hyphen. Maybe, maybe Luke can get it in the chat. Luke can pop it in the Shutter, chat. Shutter, how are you? Are you well? Are you well this evening? Mm. Yes. Yeah. Excited for the show. Uh, and do you do you love your corporate overlords? Are you? Yeah. yeah. I mean, they can only nod. Oh. So, um, oh no. Yeah. yeah oh, yeah. Shutter. Yeah. Uh, oh dear. So uh, yeah, uh, but yeah, great. You look you look wonderful. I love I love the the scrubbing up. Yeah. Beautiful. Yeah, that bow tie. So, Show me up. So, oh well. I've got silver. Know. I didn't want to say it. Oh, it spins as well. Did you see? <laughs> Oh, that's amazing. Very, very impressive. Well, we are so glad to uh, have, a, have a little helper tonight. Uh, and yeah, I suppose we should, we should get right into the show, should we? Is everybody ready? Everybody yeah. Are you ready? Excited? I'm ready. You ready? I'm ready. Shutter's ready. ready. Shutter's ready. I all think right. we're all prepared. Let's, let's kick it off, shall we? Our What's, first category. What is it? It is going to be excellence in sculpture. Oh my goodness, what a category. My favourite one, I really like this one because it's the first, some, some fun facts. We all know I love a fun fact. Uh, when we were first planning the MP Awards, sculpture was the very first uh, award category we put on the whiteboard. Oh my at goodness! At the top. So this is this is the OG. The OG category. Yeah. Shutter, how are you feeling about this? Can you can you do kind of a, a best sculpture? A best sculpture impression? Or oh, the thinker, very good. Very good. <laughs> All sorts of fun. Impressive. This little bot, incredible. Well, I know we have so many brilliant uh, nominees for this mm. category. Let's. Take a look. Jaw dropping. I love gorgeous them every time. Wonderful stuff. Mm. So, I mean, let's have a few comments. I yes. Suppose. So something we're doing a little bit differently this year is we're going to we've obviously we get an amazing panel of judges um, looking at these categories. We've actually gathered some comments from those judging sessions because one of my one of the things I'd love to do is just show you those conversations because it's amazing to hear those those really talented folks talking such wonderful words about everything that you do. Mm -hmm. um, so we've summarized them on little bits of card. So we'll be reading those. So I'm going to start with the sculpture one. If you would. <coughs> <coughs> all the nominees showcased all the nominees showcased what's possible when sculpting in dreams, ranging from the photorealistic to sculptures that captured the perfect dream spirit. Our winner took our judge's breath away through the uniqueness and overall design of the sculpt, speaking perfectly to what's possible with the dream sculpture tools. Oh my goodness, amazing. Well, let's announce our first <gasps> MP winner. The winner of excellence in sculpture is Imp by Lilia Cola 81. Woo! Cool. 
Congratulations. I love him so much. It's, it's very cool. Very cool. It's very, very cool. And a th massive thank you to our panel of judges, including the esteemed Karima Tooney. Yes, thank you so much, Kareem, for joining us. Absolutely wonderful. Oh my goodness, what a way to kick it. First one, First good, one. you're good. First one, I'm good. You're good, you're good. You're good. good. Chat's good, good. <laughs> Chat's everyone's good. good, I'm good. Amazing, let's get on to the next category, which is excellence in art direction. Very, very cool category. Mm -hmm. This is a sculpture, quite a specific category. Art direction is more about the sort of general approach to the visuals in a dream's creation, whether that's a game, a music video, anything really. It's about the kind of overall artistic vision. Um, loads of amazing, amazing people up for this award. Yeah. Let's check out the nominees. Amazing, so right? good. <laughs> so, so good. All of them, such worthy nominees, but there can only be one winner. Only one, and our judges for Excellence in Art Direction had this to say about the nominees and the winner. They said, our winner for Excellence in Art Direction takes the win through its consistently exciting and professional stylized visuals, supported by its delightful props and characters and consistency in style, despite featuring several contrasting locations within the creation. Who's our winner, Tom? Oh, are we ready? Are we ready? Our winner for excellence in art direction is... Trip's Voyage by Euphalace, Avox23 and Actual Jimmy Jam. Amazing. Congratulations, huge, Youth Belays. Huge. And team. Oh, I love, Shatter, I love your clapping then. That was amazing. Clap. That's a little... Golf clap. Thank you so much to our panel of judges who helped us judge this award, including special guest judge Anna Hollenrake from Electric Saint. Super, super cool. Thank you so much. On to our next one. Uh, we're, we've started with the art categories, mm -hmm. and our, our third and final art category is the one for excellence in environment art. It's all about creating those jaw-dropping locations, transporting the, the players and the, the viewers to brand new uh, spaces, mm -hmm. um, and our nominees really do uh, capture that. My goodness, they do. Let's take a look. So unique, what amazing. memorable places. I feel like I've actually been to every single one of those. Yeah. <laughs> They're amazing. Interestingly, mm -hmm. <laughs> this category, I just so happen to have uh, the fitting sentence to Do follow you on now. there, yes. <laughs> this category placed our judges into five totally different, yet equally jaw-dropping locations. But our winner, which we're going to reveal really in a minute, takes the MP with its beautifully showcased scenes, moody lighting, 
and intriguing environmental storytelling. <gasps> who could it who be? Who could it be? All right, let's get ready to announce our winner for excellence in environment. The winner, the MP, is Vineland 2 by Zeke and Vitamin D90. Woo! Congratulations, Zeke and Vitamin G. That's the second win for the Vineland Saga. Oh my gosh, much deserved. Huge, huge win. So cool, so, 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 so cool. And a massive thank you to our uh, returning guest judge for this category, Anna Hollenrake from uh, Electric Saint. Amazing, doing the most, yes. as always. Thank we're, you, Anna. We're three, we're three in. We are three. We're good. I, yeah, I'm feeling yeah. good. Shutter, Shutter hopefully. you good? All good. Or only can say yes, though. That, again, yes. So, uh, like positive, I, positive presence. I love that. Yeah. Positive mental like attitude. That. Chat's you know? good. You're doing good. <laughs> Everyone's having fun. Everybody knows. Excellent. Wonderful. Well, I think we could take a little break um, because we do actually have some more archive footage to share from oh, nice. uh, kind of the, uh, the nominations. Let's, uh, let's uh, throw it over to there and find out a little bit more about this uh, unique place we're holding the awards in. Ah, yes, the cow stall. The silver lining to the disaster that was the crabaclism. Who holds the genius to unlock the anti gravity potential of these gems? No hard passage, trusty drone boss. Not you. Never. Why? Nom com, of course. Your friendly man and conglomerate. Ought to be exact. The nomination conglomeration. The specialists are here. On hand. And on top of it, these boffins work day and night to refine the precious materials of the Cold Storm to enable our islands to take flight, thus saving our glorious nomination. Whoa, the Nelly! I dare say we have a breakthrough. Taking flight into the sky, Nomcom protects us from the deadly crab below, and also raising monuments, lest we forget our previous monster attacks that besmirched our land and the honor of the MP Awards themselves. Glory to Nomcom, protecting us and the MP Awards, always from that giant crab. Nomination Archive, sponsored by Nomcom Film, a subsidiary of the associated companies and legally innocuous corporate operations of the nomination conglomerate. Here we go. Glory to Nomcom indeed. I'm so, I'm so sold on this place. It's fascinating. I know. Isn't it nice? Yeah. I've really enjoyed kind of wandering around. Yeah, like seeing what what rich all history. Yeah, so much culture. And it here. seems so chill. It is. Isn't it? It's, it's, it just seems super chill, relaxing, really relaxing. Basically. Like, Shata, I'm, I'm, I'm really happy to be here with you. Yeah, and I mean, thank you again, Nomcom, for providing, yeah. uh, you know, all we need to make this show really, really great. We absolutely... Thank you, Nomcom. Delighted. Right, what are we up to? Next we time? are on to our next category, which mm -hmm. is going to be excellence in animation. Goodness, amazing. What's an animation all about? What is animation all about, the, Jen? The concept. The concept of are animation. You turn that back on. Yeah, me? I was going to. Say well, that. I, I suppose it's all about those creators who, um, you know, put an enormous amount of work into making things look beautiful in motion. Yeah. You know, poetic almost, you might say, fluid, kind of exciting, expressive, characterful, and my goodness, our nominees. Just wait until you see them. They absolutely exude that. So I think we can roll those. That's a good word. Right now. Well then. Brashley over there, he used to have a pet possum, but wait, wait, let's not bring that up, please. Listen, next spring we can get you another one. Some assist. Yes, Captain. Prepare the airlock and ready the observation deck. Then he's going to go outside. Oh, this is gonna be good. Oh, 
about those? So good. Animation, there's such a secret sauce to making the animation look super smooth. Oh, I love that. <laughs> Thank you. Secret sauce. I thought of that two seconds ago. <laughs> You know, you could never tell. No. You could never tell. Wonderful stuff. Well, our judges really enjoyed judging this panel. Um, and yeah, they had some comments uh, about the process of judging nice. excellence in animation. Here they are. Judging animation in dreams over the years has always been a tough one. We've had everything from full stories to 2D pixel games. Take the MP home. This year's winner stole the hearts of our judges with its incredible level of polish, its charm, and irresistible personality. Who's the winner? Who is the winner? <laughs> Our winner for excellence in animation is... Astro Thumb Stories 2 by Arsony 3D. Submissions! Yes, The big air lap ready the observation deck. That is gonna go outside. Oh, this is gonna be cool. <laughs> Yeah. Now this is really nice. Wait. Oh, this ain't good. Help me, help me Congratulations, Arsony 3D. Oh my goodness. Big thumbs up. Big thumbs uh, up. Nice. Get it. What a win. And thank you so much to our panel of judges for judging this award, including special guest judge, Davey Swatpats Ferguson. Who, of course, took an impy home. Yeah, the very first year for uh, Witchy Woods. The funniest creation. Incredible stuff. Thank you for coming back. Um, and yeah, absolutely great stuff. Loving yeah. it. Loving it. What are we moving on to next? We are moving on to the category for excellence in character. And I'm going to, I just need to check in the shutters, okay? Gee! Oh, my goodness. Oh, well, no. Oh, we, we asked her to come she, and... She did say yeah. that she would like to come and present the award for... It's amazing how that, how she can just sneak up on she you like that. She sort of appears... Um, she's been around the nominations, of course, you know, yeah. selling you yeah, she's Yeah, I'm, I might pop by after the show to Little get... Little side uh, hustle going yeah. on. We love it. We love that for you. Amazing. Nice, nice. Amazing, babe. Great stuff. Anyway, yes, here she is, all of a sudden, um, uh, to help present our award for excellence in character design. Of course, we've got so many amazing characters out there in the dream of us. Unforgettable, uh, you know, super memorable, sometimes mm. inescapable. Yeah, um, <laughs> totally. And, you know, a re an award very close to her heart. Um, so, yeah, how about we see some of these? Let's, let's check out the nominees for excellence in character design. They're amazing, Connie. They're brilliant. Yes. You just love them all. Big fan. Big fan. Oh, look, she's doing here. a wobble. She know, you know she's excited the when she starts shaking. <laughs> yeah. yeah, and then the whole world starts shaking and yeah. then you start to wonder what power she really has. Anyway, what did our judges <laughs> think of the winner for excellence in character design? <laughs> well, as you can see here, Connie, they were amazed at the fully realised characters across the board, but our winner takes the, takes the prize home because of their fleshed out animations. Oh, fleshed out. Yeah. <laughs> oh. That was that was I'm that so was sorry. that was dark. Continue. Uh, their their emotions and providing an iconic mascot vibe. I honestly didn't know she could read. No. Yeah. Anyway, our winner for excellence in character design is <laughs> Scraps by Mittermack. <laughs> Dis 
disappears. She's back off to the side, hustle. Yeah, she's got to get back to work, Love feeding it. those hun- hungry, hungry nommy... What, what's a nomination per- local called? I'm not sure, actually. A nomination You probably need to ask, ask Ollie Grant, who's Ollie Grant. very clever at these. Yeah, <laughs> the, as in, like, the, the, the creator of the nominations. So well, I mean, the impo- the, like the, Yeah, <laughs> the meister of we'll the nominations. We'll ask on the break. Anyway, yeah, oh, nice. my goodness, congratulations, Mittermack. Amazing oh, huge, win. huge win. And a massive thank you to our judges, including our guest judge, Ricky Haggett of Ricky Haggett. Haggett? Haggis? Wow. I know he said Haggis then. Oh, nearly. Sorry, Ricky. <laughs> we love you lots. Uh, from Hollow Ponds. Yeah, amazing. You know, of course, worked on games such as Hohokam. Yes. My goodness. Games full of character. Mm-hmm. Super, super excited to have you on. Ten your one, your teens. Shout out. What game? <laughs> anyway, Shutter. Shut, you good? How do you feel about back that? back now. Sorry, you got... You got Kind of, coned. kind of coned there yeah. for a little bit. But, yeah. I mean, how did you feel about it? Do you, do you like Connie? How, what's the... Oh. oh. Sparks, sparks flying? Sparks flying a little bit. Oh. oh. Okay. Oh. All right. I ship it. Goodness um. me. <laughs> anyway. Goodness me. My goodness. So much excitement, but there's more to come. Because, my goodness, I actually am getting something in my earpiece. Oh, you have an earpiece? Yeah. Well, you know. Wow. It's very, very small. Very tiny. Fine. You, Fine. you wouldn't believe the things they're saying to me in this thing. <laughs> anyway, we have some footage, I believe, uh, coming in live <gasps> from around the nominations. Um... Uh, regarding a very interesting wildlife phenomenon that Ooh. occurs in the nominations every year. Uh, can we can we throw to this, please? Levitating two kilometres above the prolific ocean, the island of Isavibe. Every year it hosts thousands of visitors who come to enjoy the white sands of its coastline and the stunning views of the nominations archipelago. However, come springtime, it's another kind of visitor that is crowding the beaches. A migration of mega penguins. These spacefaring penguins spend just one week visiting Isabibe each year, collecting pebbles, lifting weights at the Mussel Beach, and socializing at the many nightlife spots all in the hope of attracting a mate. Competition for attention is fierce. It looks like this mega penguin will return to outer space alone. Hi, my name is Chloe, also known as Sinok the Hodgehog, and I'm part of QA here at MM. This year has been so full of amazing creations, and a particular highlight for me has to be RID, Memories of the Elders. I went into the game not really knowing what to expect, but once I climbed up from that opening beach area, I was floored by the amazing world that had been created. I opened up the in-game map and saw what I was seeing was just a small fraction of the game world, and it reminded me of a core game in memory when I first entered a certain 3D field for the first time. Made by just two people, it's an incredible action-adventure game, a stunning achievement and an important milestone of what can be achieved in dreams, and I highly recommend it. Hey, so so much, so much to unpack in the last couple of minutes there. I know, we heard from Chloe. Hi, Chloe. Hopefully in the chat. Repping that bear story. Bear story merch. Chuckle we fun. Love we love it. And of course, a little bit of uh, uh, insight into the habits of yeah. the mega penguins. So that so they're here. Yeah. So this do is you kind think, of the, Do you think our, our boy knows? I, I think I think maybe. Wow. I think maybe we might see a little bit of the boy. Um, oh. But yeah, what an amazing insight into yeah. some of the wildlife uh, native to the nominations. Incredible stuff. Um, but yeah, we let's keep going. Let's, let's keep going. Some, keep on rolling. Some Shut awards, you good. Awards vibes. Yeah, yeah as good. always. Wonderful. Well, our next category is excellence in VR. An amazing category all about being transported to completely different worlds sometimes, doing all sorts of things, really feeling immersed mm. in the dream of us for real. Let us check out the nominees for excellence in VR.
about that. Amazing, so cool. So, 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 some amazing VR experiences and dreams. Tom, during that break, was like, what does, what does, what does VR stand for? Yeah. And I said, very real. Which is probably the joke of the night, everybody. <laughs> Round of applause for Jen for that good joke. Job. That was good work. That was, that was great work. Yeah. Well done, well done. Just spreading misinformation In absolute awe. <laughs> Wonderful. Well, what a category. Our judges had a ball judging it. And uh, we've got a little a little blurb to read you all about judging excellence in VR. It says, a good VR experience puts you in the action. And all our nominees did just that for our judges. Our winner, though, impressed the panel with its attention to detail in graphics and gameplay and the way it embraced the VR tools in Dreams. But who is it? Who is it? I know. I'm about to say. Oh, God. Our winner. Excellence in VR is The Range by Carsten Stack. Congratulations. Amazing, Carsten. What a worthy, worthy winner. Thank you so much to our judges. And especially to our guest judge, the wonderful Ian Higdon. Hi, Ian. From Hello. Eurogamer. A super, super passionate fan of VR. Yes. <laughs> wonderful stuff. Yes. Right. Yes. What are we on to next? We're moving on to uh, the finer details of excellence in gameplay. Wonderful stuff. What a category. Yeah. Oh, my goodness. Of course, a huge array of amazing games and dreams with just some top tier, top quality gameplay, mechanics, design work. My goodness, absolutely spoilt for choice on this category. Let's take a look at our nominees. Such a tough category. Loads of good memories as yeah. well. Yes. Came through all of those this year. And it's just amazing because it's just the variety on show. Like not, not, no two games are the same Absolutely. in dreams as evidenced by this, by this shortlist. I know, amazing stuff. Well, what did our judges have to say about what, this that, illustrious category? I don't know what that was. I don't know. It's a bit of a I don't know what this is. All right. Anyway. Shake it. Go for it. All our nominees wowed with their ideas and all-round craftsmanship. Love that. Our winner, however, wins thanks to their incredibly smooth gameplay, scope, and overall professionalism. Oh, wow. Wow. Yeah. Well, let's reveal the winner for excellence in gameplay. This year's winner of the Impy is Trips Voyage by Euphalace, Abox 23, and Actual Jimmy Jam. Woo! Second win Second of the win. night. Incredible very, stuff. Very, very exciting. <laughs> Congratulations, folks. And thank you to our amazing judges, including Ebonics and Mr. Dalek JD. Oh, my goodness. Such an honor to have them help judge our category on our panel of judges for such an exciting category. But yeah. we've got another really exciting one coming up, really close to my heart. Yes. This one is most original gameplay. And this is just celebrating some of, uh, you know, the most novel and unique ideas for games and interactive experiences in dreams. I love it because it's all about embracing the weird and the wonderful. <laughs> and the oh my gosh, you two. You've one mind. Very in sync. One, one brain battery. One, one brain cell. Yeah, say. do you have cells? <laughs> Oh, let's not get... Oh, no. and not. Oh. Again, but, we but don't only know. not. So. Yeah. 
Who knows? Who knows? Who knows? Who we'll knows? find out. We'll find out. My goodness. Well, I would love to get a look at who's up for this, Tom. Should yeah. Let us let us check out the nominations for most original gameplay. Weird, wonderful, but also just fantastic. Oh, what a, what a group. I just mm. love all of them. Really enjoyed my own time with all of those. And my goodness, I cannot wait to give out the award. <sighs> I've got some notes from our judges from their time uh, judging this award. Uh, and here's what they had to say. All five of our nominees presented our judges with an original idea or an original take on an existing idea, which meant that this was a tough category to call. But in the end, our winner created a gameplay experience in Dreams that's truly original, totally unexpected, and a whole lot of fun. Our winner for most original gameplay is... Cubus by Stino Alpino and Dee Dee Forks. Gosh, congratulations, Cubus team. Oh, so enjoyed my time talking to them. Yes. At Dreams Con. Yes. Absolutely mm. incredible. Thank you so much to our guest judges uh, for judging this category, including very, very special guest judge, Khalif Adams from Sport on Me. Thank you so much, Khalif. Long time friend of the show. Love you, Khalif. Something really exciting happened when Jimmy we were watching that winner reel. Oh, yeah. I got an earpiece. Oh. Yeah, Nomcom representative came in. They were like, I've got a gift. Stuck it here oh I'd, I'd be i'd be wary about letting them stick too much in nah it's in, fine in, in. absolutely fine but what they are telling me now is we're going to go live to check out some extracurricular activities taken uh, that uh, are participated in by some of the wildlife oh let's go There, there's Mega Penguin. There he is. Not only the, is the fleet being found, dedication to the craft. <laughs> Incredible. I love it. It's becoming a mentor. You yeah. Know? Like, you know, teaching people how to get swole down at Muscle Beach. <laughs> love that. Thank you so much to the Nomination Network. Yes. For, uh, showing us a little bit of their broadcasting there. Wonderful stuff. Also, and, those, I mean, those impy statues are 
are not light. No, 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 no. no. That is a, not light. That is a beautiful dumbbell right there. Yes. That, that'll get you swallowed. I mean, yeah. I feel inspired to, yes. to, to lift some weights. How about you, Shutter? How are you feeling? Mm. Is, is that... Is, oh, yeah. We're Ooh. pumped up. Ooh. We're pumped up, I believe. Oh, my gosh. Wow, wow. okay. All right. Get, nice. All right. Get it. All right. <laughs> Love that. Love that. I feel a little inadequate. <laughs> all right. Well, you know, let's keep it moving along. <laughs> what are we up to next? <laughs> Our next few categories are all about the beats, the bangers, and the bops oh, of the Dreamverse. It's all about raising the roof. Raising Sh the roof. Shutter, can we get a raise the roof, we please? Can we get a raise the roof? Oh my god! Whoa! Oh. Okay. Uh, I uh, mean, that's a little bit more oh. literal than I, yep. <laughs> I was expecting, but uh, great. I mean, however you interpret that, that's wonderful. You good? Uh, fantastic stuff. Very yes. Good. My goodness, so much incredible music yeah. uh, in the Dreamverse out there. I have been enjoying many a music track across the course of the last yeah. twelve months. Um, how it's about fitting that we're starting with music track of the year? Yeah, absolutely love that. Let's let's take a look at our nominees for music track of the year. There is, I, I am, there is a discourse in my head of like what becomes a bop, what's a banger, and what's a beat. Oh, wow. All five of those, all three of them. I, I would love to dig into that after the show and just kind of... Oh, we can just get started now if you want. Like, we can just put everything on pause. Well, we've only got so much time. We do. So. Yeah, we've got <laughs> a bunch more categories to go through. Absolutely. So what did our judges have to say about music track of the year? So they were really impressed with how each track this year represented such different genres, which is always one of the joys of this category yeah. anyway. Um, but something that makes it very tricky to judge. This year's winner, however, spoke to all of our judges and has become the unofficial but totally official theme tune of MMHQ. I believe it year. has. Let's get ready to reveal our winner for music track of the year. And the winner of the interview is... Goth Egg Slip and Fall by Seafall James and Cat Malinger. My 
De- just, definitively a banger. I think we might have had a riot on our hands. Yes. <laughs> it wasn't yeah. gothic. Oh. But my goodness, thank goodness the judges were, yeah. were fully on board. On it. <laughs> yeah. uh, our guest judge for that category was the amazing Grant Kirkhope, composer of the soundtracks for GoldenEye 64 and Banjo Kazooie. Oh I have lived a full life. <laughs> Now that I have heard Grant Kirkhope talk about goth egg with such passion. Honestly, it was a delight to see. Thank you so much, Grant, for coming on to helping us judge that category. Wonderful stuff. Well, the next category on our list is somewhat linked to the... Somewhat Beats tenuously, Box you know. ...multiverse. It is Musician of the Year. My goodness. So many talented, talented, talented musicians out there in the dream of us doing some incredible, incredible stuff. Uh, we might actually be hearing from one of them towards the end of the show. Uh, so stay tuned for that. Um, but yeah, I am super excited to ha- get the trophies going out for this category. <laughs> My goodness. Super exciting. Let's check out the nominations for Musician of the Year. I'm also going to add jams, beats, bangers, bops, and jams. Wow. It doesn't flow as well. Moving away from the alliteration. Yeah, I yeah, like that. You yeah. Know, yeah. Give me yeah. yeah, it's like boom. Love that. Another super strong category, my goodness. Uh, and we've got this to say about Musician of the Year. Our judges were absolutely blown away by each and every nominee in this category, not just at the quality of their music, but at the consistency of it too, especially those who have produced albums. Ultimately, our winner was chosen for both these things, but also the variety of their output spanning so many different styles and genres. Are you ready? Oh, I'm ready. Shut, are you ready? Shut is ready. <laughs> our winner for, for, for Musician of the Year is Seafull James. <laughs> Congratulations, Seafull James. Oh my gosh. Seafull Jams. Oh, oh, oh well, that's <laughs> I've had that in the, the brain box for two more seconds. I know how much I love Seafull James, especially Hyperpop. Shout out Hyperpop. What a track. 
Congratulations so much on your MP. And thank you to our panel of judges for this award, including our very special guest judge returning once again for the MPs, Barry Epoch Topping from Polygon Bird Games, and also the composer of the soundtrack for Paradise Killer. Thank Th you, Barry. <laughs> thank you, thank you, thank you. Right, I think it's time to hear from another of our wonderful molecules. There are so many. Yeah. Take it away, Luke. Hey Dreamers, Luke here. Firstly, I just wanted to give a massive congratulations to all of the nominees in the fourth annual MP Award. I wanted to give a big shout out to Liminal by Ramstein and many collaborators. You scared the heebie-jeebies of the entire Dreamiverse, basically every molecule, and specifically Tom Den with your brilliant horror game. I also just want to give two mini shout outs to Tapio and Venwave. I absolutely love your art styles. Tapio, I absolutely adore your hyper realistic and surrealist art pieces. If you're watching this and haven't seen Video Dream System, definitely go ahead and check out because that basically embodies all of the wonders that Tapio makes. Venwave, what's not to love about your cozy, adorable, PS1 vibes art style. I cannot place into words how much I love it. And if you haven't checked out Venway's creations, definitely go ahead and check out Housewave or Tides as a starting point because that, again, kind of embodies uh, the amazingness of what they create. Thank you, Luke. He's right there. Hi. Yeah, there he is. There he is. We love it. I mean, he's talking to the camera now oh, about course. the... Absolutely. Maybe those bits two aren't live. <laughs> two places as well, at once. That's, yes. That's, that's why you get so much done. Yeah. Oh, <laughs> amazing, amazing, amazing. Right, what are we on to next? All right, we're on to our third audio category mm -hmm. of the evening mm -hmm. or the morning or the afternoon, wherever you're watching this, mm -hmm. uh, which is excellence in audio design, which is all about creating the right atmosphere, the implementation of your audio in your creation, um, which our nominees did, may I say, excellently. Wonderful stuff. All right, let's have a listen to the nominees, shall we? have been blessed. They have, they have. I've got my card. Mm -hmm. I'm going to let you know mm -hmm. about the, our winner Please from the do. judges. Please do. Our winner for excellence in audio design. I'm not going to say who it is. That's Jen's, that's Jen's job. <laughs> our winner takes home the MP due to its genius implementation of audio and utterly unique vibe. Oh, wow. Love that. Let's mm. find out who's worthy of these wonderful words. <sighs> <laughs> shall we? Shall we? Shall we? I think we shall. The winner for excellence in audio design is Tides by Venway. Huge shout out to Venwave, <laughs> amazing, amazing work. And a massive thank you to our guest judge for that category, the amazing Kenny Young, composer of soundtracks for Astrobot, Little Big Planet, and Tearaway. We love you lots, Kenny. Quite fond of Kenny for obvious reasons. Yeah, big fans, big fans, <laughs> big, big fans. fans. Big fans, wonderful stuff. Right, moving on to our next category, another audio-based one. Oh. Uh, it is excellence in voice acting. So many dreamers out there in the dreamverse uh, getting into voice acting, performing some amazing characterful uh, voice acting uh, and really bringing to life, uh, you know, scripts, characters, entire stories, just with the power of their voice. It's been one of my favorite things uh, for people to get involved in dreams because er like everyone loves, like everyone always is really interested in voice acting and mm -hmm. obviously it's, it's super simple to get involved in dreams. Yeah. 
And uh, we've seen some, so many people discover their passion for it yeah. um, and find a real talent for it. It's uh, lovely. It's fantastic. I love seeing it happen. And let's see our nominees uh, for Excellence in Voice Acting. Princess Tommy, I can't not believe this. Wait for mine headache to leave her first. Wherefore art thou speaking like yond? Heavens! Mine own tongue be cursed! Au même instant, non loin de là, à une demi-lieue très exactement, un énorme loup rôdait autour d'une maisonnette. Just gotta make my way down and I can. No! Solace! Hang on! To build anything, you've got to place the first brick in the wall. You've done just that. So good for you. Wonderful. I love those nominees because it's not all just about acting as a character. We've got all sorts of different voiceovers, which is something our judges really enjoyed. Which I'm now going to read. That was, Go great. That was a great. In, that was a great intro to this. Great segue. Uh, thank you. Uh, when judging this category, our panel were in awe of the quality of the voice acting and how well it hooked them into the creations, especially when used in a setting that is more than just voicing a character, like a narration or tutorial. Okay, wonderful stuff. Well, let's find out who's won the MP. The winner <laughs> for excellence in voice acting is Elfiu in Il était une fois. Congratulations! Au même instant, loin de là, à une demi-lieue très exactement, un énorme loup rôdait autour d'une maisonnette. Motivée par la faim, la bête frappa. Et une vieille dame ouvrit. En deux temps trois mouvements, l'animal sauta sur sa. Uh, What's going on out there? I'm not sure, but it looks it looks like health and safety is nowhere to be found. Oh, uh, but she was. Well, yeah, I'm a bit worried. I feel like can we can we get a check on Mega Penguin? Please, 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 please because it's, it's okay, Shutter. Important. Don't don't worry, don't worry, don't worry. Okay, all right. Well, um, maybe we'll find out what's going on out there. We're we're safe in here, thanks to Nomcom. Glory to Nomcom. Uh, shout outs. A exactly. Yes. Um, okay. Um, but anyway, back to the show. Congratulations, Elfiu. We believe you might be watching. Uh, hello. Hello, 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 hi, hello, hi, hello, hi. hello. Congrats. Uh, and thank you so much to our panel of judges for excellence in voice acting, including special guest judges, Inel Tomlinson and Sebastian Croteau from Monster Factory, who actually did the voices for the monsters in Ancient Dangers. Thank you, folks. <laughs> right. All right. Our next category is the excellence in narrative. It's all about telling those stories and bringing us in, keeping us uh, glued, transfixed. Mm. What's another word? Fascinated? Yes. I need to stop seeing, thinking of words, otherwise yeah. we're going to keep describing Tom what this category Bent, is all about. Tom Bent, Aren't goodness. I just? Very, very apt for narrative, yes. which is all about, you know, the power of words to uh, produce beautiful images and stories. Uh, and yeah. Keep us, keep us glued, man. Yeah, boom. We totally do. Uh, wonderful stuff. We've got an amazing stacked category of nominees. Uh, let's take a look at our storytellers. It's only been five years since we arrived on the planet. There's no record of anyone being in this area either. I don't know. I'll send a recording to the base and request instructions. <laughs> Oh, my God. 
do my nice to see this. Princess Connie, I can't not believe this. Wait for mine headache to leave her first. Wherefore art thou speaking like yond? Heavens! Mine own tongue be cursed! Just love them all. <laughs> so good. Now, it was, as always, a close race mm -hmm. for this category. Mm -hmm. Each of our nominees impressed our judges in different ways. Our winner, though, takes the MP home due to its clever interactive narrative and memorable final sequence that stuck with all of our judges while they'd finished playing. Mm, <gasps> interesting. Who could, Who could it be? Let's find What's out our be? winner for excellence in narrative. The winner is... Yellarophobia by Grothrol! <laughs> Congratulations, Grothrol. Congratulations. Still oh slightly recovering from playing it at Halloween. Yes, I bet you but are. But <laughs> like they say, that's, the ending sticks with you. It certainly, certainly does. Amazing. What an achievement. Thank you so much to our judges. Uh, in particular, our very special guest judge, Sam Barlow from Half Mermaid. And of course, one of the creators behind the amazing Immortality. Oh my goodness. So and many fave. of us. <laughs> <laughs> there you go. Luke is whooping. We are all big fans. <laughs> Thank you so much, Sam, for your time. Wonderful, wonderful stuff. We hope yeah. you enjoyed checking out our narrative focus streamers. Our next, uh, our next like batch of categories are our community voted categories, um, which we all put out, and you vote on them. Um, so thank you, Jeez! Oh, oh my goodness! I, I, I didn't did know not they could, know they could do that. I did not know they could that do was, that. That was impressive. It's like well we're done. discovering more functions yeah. all the time. <laughs> Yeah, great job. Good work, great good job. work, good work. Oh. <laughs> yes, thank you to uh, everyone that voted on these categories. All these winners have been chosen by you lovely lot. Um, so yeah, that's, these, that's what these next categories are about. But what's our first one? Wonderful, wonderful stuff. Our yeah. first category for the community voted categories is Curation Star. Very, very exciting category near and dear to my heart jacobs as well i'm sure yeah. over there yeah little whoop uh we love the curators of the dreamiverse who just spend so much of their time sort of uh gathering together creations and pieces of art and music all on different themes platforming them getting them in front of eyes getting them the the adm admiration that they deserve um doing so much of the work behind the scenes we love our curators let's take a look at the nominees <laughs> Such an important category to the dream, to the dream of us, to dreams as a whole, mm -hmm. um, and people have really found their their their, their calling and their role uh, amongst the community. It's wonderful to see, and we've got a little blurb about the curation star category and our winner. It says this award recognizes people in dreams who do the important job of finding, curating, and platforming the pearls found in the ocean of creations that is dreams. All of our nominees were selected for their creativity and care while doing so, and the community's chosen winner exemplifies what it means to be a truly dedicated curator. Who's it going to be? Who is it? <laughs> our winner of Curation Star in the Awards is. Lady Lex UK. Congratulations. Congratulations. Such a deserved win. Amazing, amazing work, Lex. Thank you so much. Well done, Lex. Amazing stuff. And thank you to the community for voting on this category. My goodness, great job. What are we up to next? Our next category is for Most Helpful Dreamer, which again is an amazingly important uh, category, rec recognising the, the stars of the community that go above and beyond helping their fellow dreamers, uh, creating, lending tips, getting involved, even something as simple as leaving a review 
or a comment on their creations. Completely. We are so lucky to have so many helpful dreamers out there in the Dreamiverse. Um, but here are our nominees for this year's Impy Award. Oh, and I did find a better faulting solution. I would keep the two stages, but for the initial vertical leap, I simply take the Y coordinates of the vaultable object using a raycast and force the player to move to that height. can't see it on the the like white wall but as you go like that you can see it through the, the black sure enough the cape bends stretches and squishes just like we want it to <laughs> amazing amazing people Amazing people. And for this one, uh, we actually got some. We've got some comments from the community. Oh, wonderful! On their on their winner. Um, so again, voted on. Uh, obviously, originally submitted by as well. Everyone that's nominated tonight was originally submitted by the community. Wonderful. Uh, so thank you, everyone that got involved. Yeah. So the comments about our winner. They consistently help other dreamers with their online tutorials and personal tips and tricks, because their passion for dreams and helping others never never falters, and the dreams community as a whole is so helpful. Everyone is willing to share what they know and lend a hand, but there is only one of this person. That is absolutely true. Let's get ready to crown our winner for most helpful dreamer. The winner of this year's image is Tap Giles! <laughs> so now you've got this effect where you can't see it on the, the like white wall. But as you go like that, you can see it through the... Congratulations, Tap. Hopefully you're still here. Yeah, hopefully you haven't not, got dinner. Not dinner yet. Not dinner yet. <laughs> Congratulations. We absolutely love what you do. Great job on the MP. And Wonderful we stuff. actually have a... Shutter has a celebration. Oh, really? In the, in the In the honour of Tap Giles. Shutter, take it away. Hey! As, <laughs> as close as they can get to tap dancing. <laughs> Without legs. Yes. You know. Amazing work. Well done. Well done. Well done. Well done. Well done. Oh, a little trooper. Yeah. Wonderful stuff. Thank you so much to everyone who submitted, nominated, and voted on that category. My goodness. Great, great job. Um, okay, right. Well, I think we're ready to hear from a couple more of our molecules. I believe Excellent. we have some lovely, lovely words from the amazing Joe and Cena. Take it away. Hi, everyone. It's Joe from uh, the localization team. Um, I wanted to once again share my love for uh, Infinity Dreams. Uh, my favorite creation of last year is Il était une fois. It's hilarious. Uh, you need to go play it. Uh, yeah, and I love it. Hello. I just wanted to give a shout out to the amazing creation Looking True by Toto. I really love the simple, elegant design and the really nice twists on the puzzles throughout the game. So great work on it and I'm looking forward to more creations from you. Amazing. And a couple of molecules that may be new to some of the community members. Yes. It's awesome to see some new faces. Yeah, so nice to have everyone along for the impies. My goodness. Are we, are we calling that like the Cena slide? The Cena slide. Oh, Cena slide? I like that. I feel like the we Cena slide. It's, yes. It's, it's, pretty, it's a pretty sweet move. Yeah. <laughs> good work, Cena. Good, good work. Right. Our next category is uh, one that I'm really, really happy that we introduced. I think we introduced it last year. Oh, did we? Yeah, I think it was last year. It's the Breakthrough Dreamer Award, which is all about celebrating uh, dreamers that made a name for themselves either like came into the dreamverse in the last 12 months or really sort of made their mark with a creation or their efforts with the community um, and just really like have been spotlighted by the rest of the community some real up and comers some yes. real movers and shakers let's check out the nominees for breakthrough dreamer It's 
just keeps going. Report says they have about 52 miles mapped out at the other gates. Excellent folk, excellent creations. So good. Excellent all round. I feel like we've had moments with all of those people this year where we've just suddenly been blown away. And yeah. Like, Who is this? Who did this? And then, yeah. and then you discover it. Yeah. Like, oh, okay. they're really, really Fan good. For life. Yeah. <laughs> huh? I call my breath. You're right. I'm all good. Okay. I'm all good. I'm the all hype, good. Yeah. It's all getting good. too much. It's, it's too exciting, everybody. <laughs> Confirmed. Yes. Wonderful. Well, all right. what, did our, what did our judges have to say about Breakthrough Dreamer? This category is filled with nominees who have burst on scene this past year, whether they joined the Dreamiverse in the past 12 months and immediately made a big impact, 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 an impact, or finally got their big break through a brilliant idea. It was an incredibly competitive category this year, but the community's winner has managed to scare off the competition. Oh my goodness, right, who could be <laughs> our winner for Breakthrough Dreamer? Let's get it going, Shutter. We have the winner for Breakthrough Dreamer. The MP goes to Marshall's account! Woo! Yes! My God. Yeah, so far, Gator. Yes, I'm so excited for the last, uh, well, last or the next episode. Of the back rooms. Oh my gosh, we've uh, all been enjoying it so much. Oh, it's, it's fantastic. Really been a hit throughout. A ripping story. Wonderful stuff. Bit maybe a bit too scary for Shutter. <laughs> yeah, maybe amazing. Oh, great job, Marshall's account. Um, yeah. Great, great job on the MP, and thank you everyone who's voting. Uh, yes, thank that. you everybody that's getting involved <laughs> in all of these. Brilliant stuff. Right, our next category, moving on to community collaboration, which is, again, super, super special. It's all about people across the dream of us coming together to work on projects uh, that are super, super ambitious, yeah. make a huge impression, sort of taking advantage of each other's skills to produce something that that's just goes beyond so much of what you can imagine, uh, yeah. just through the power of teamwork. It's pretty amazing. Well done to everyone that's been involved in a collaboration or challenge or anything this year. It's just been so inspiring. To Properly see everyone the meaning of dreams, yes. honestly. So yeah. good. Let us check out the nominees for community collaboration. So cool seeing all those projects come to life right. over the last 12 months. Amazing, amazing stuff. Big fan of this category. And here's a little blurb about community collaboration before we announce our winner. So, a celebration of what the Dreams community can achieve when it comes together. This very special category is full of nominees who've made unforgettable creations as teams, complementing each other's talents and provided experiences that brought the entire player base together. It was close, Tom. And shut up. <laughs> Our winner, though, inspired the community with an incredible commitment to quality and bucket loads of imagination, producing an event that genuinely rocked the dream of us. Who's our winner? Mm. <laughs> our winner is Dreams Fest 22 by the Dreams Fest team. Woo!
Congratulations. Amazing, amazing work by everyone involved. Oh, my goodness. Um, and a massive shout-out to uh, Bearded Cats and Disobey Games for Hi. heading that project. It's always a fantastic event. Honestly, it was such a fun summer. Yeah. So, so good. And so much of it was down to Dreams Fest 22. We absolutely loved it. Big fan. And so were the community. Thank you to the community for voting on that category uh, and voting Dreams Fest 22 your winner. Now, before we move on to our next category, we're going to hear from another molecule. Now, this molecule is behind the cameras today, making it all sound wonderful. It is the incredible Ollie Grant. Hi, everyone. I'm Ollie, and I'm a sound designer at MM. And I wanted to give a shout out to Ethlix, or Ethlix, I'm not sure exactly how you pronounce it, I'm sorry, uh, by Sackboy2003. Um, the track is incredible. The drum programming is really considered and tastefully done. Um, the chord progressions are really clever. There's really good dynamic sections within the track where they use uh, effect fields very creatively. Um, and usually some people just really, to my ears anyway, nailed that one element of the track. But for me, for the whole track, they got it all spot on. Um, so just a big shout out to them. Uh, and yeah, I look forward to everything they make in the future. Well done. What is what? going on? <laughs> what is wrong with that truck? I am quite worried. It doesn't seem to be Connie up to her no, usual No, I tricks. thought I was, I'm mistaken. Sorry, Connie. Something is very wrong in the nominations yeah, again, right now. Again, we're safe in this hall. Yes, or so we're told. Currently, yeah. Um, okay, well, hopefully the nominations network can, can get us some news later because there are some concerning things happening. Again, can we get a check on the cone, please? Yes. Thank you. Okay, uh, you. let's keep it rolling with... The next category. Our next community uh, voted category is the Contribution Beyond Dreams car category, which recognises uh, the amazing champions of dreams outside the Dreamiverse, uh, doing their bit, uh, being the, the, the stars of the community, championing the game, their fellow creators, and just being all around really nice people. Yeah, wonderful stuff. Let's take a look at some of the nominees for Contribution Beyond Dreams. Just change the color. Bam. And we have an enemy. And just like that, all of the enemies are red, all of the NPCs are blue. Au même instant, non loin de là, à une demi-lieu très exactement, un énorme loup rodé autour d'une maisonnette. So, looking for voice actors for your project on dreams. Awesome! Well, you've come to the right place. And we're here, ladies and gentlemen. Will Bear absolutely burning up. And, I'm not uh, sure I'll ever uh, get used to seeing so good. Mighty Vicious on fire. <laughs> Just so You're on fire. <laughs> as always, as, as always. As always, wonderful stuff. Right, well, I believe we have some community comments we do. We about do. our winner of Contribution Beyond Dreams. I would just love to hear them, Tom. Well, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna, I'm gonna to read them for Amazing. us. Amazing. <laughs> so this, this winner was uh, nominated for their Never Stopping Events and Support. Uh, they put a lot of effort to keep being creative and entertain players and creators. And uh, a load of folks think they are the go-to place if one wants to surround oneself with friendly and passionate 
people. Oh, that is lovely. What a ringing lovely endorsement words. Thank you so much. of our winner for Contribution Beyond Dreams. Let's get them their trophy. The winner in the Contribution Beyond Dreams is... The Infinidreams team! Au même instant, le loin de là, à une demi-lieu très exactement, un énorme loup rôdait autour d'une maisonnette. Motivée par la faim, la bête frappa et une vieille dame ouvrit. En deux temps trois mouvements, l'animal... Such a deserved win. Congratulations, Infinite Dreams team. And thank you to everyone that voted on that category. Yeah, amazing stuff. My goodness, I'm so hyped. Shutter. Such good feels. You're feeling the magic. Good. And they do mean yes. They do Even mean though yes. they can't say no. Yes, they of course do they mean do. Yes. Of course they do. Oh, I love it. I love it. If there's a way I can just get you to agree and like nod to everything I'm saying, I would love that. Yeah, yeah, yes. We'll okay. figure that out. We can sort that out. Anyway. Shutter can give me some tips. <laughs> Our next category is another one that oh, I just I just love. Little pet fave. It is innovation in create, and it's a really special category. We made it a community voted category yes. this year because actually uh, all our nominees are creators who've kind of contributed to the Dreamiverse by coming up with really innovative ideas that have actually kind of changed the Dreamiverse and people's whole approach to creating in dreams through these just outstanding novel ideas that have just changed the shape of the Dreamiverse as we know it. It's, it's a pretty big one. Tom. It is. It's an important one. And it keeps everything feeling alive and exciting. Oh, we love it. It's we love it. Great. Our nominees for Innovation in Create are... picture you're just gonna have to repeat this process. At the end you should have your own permanent picture fully imported into dreams. So that should be everything. Of course if you have any questions feel free to ask away. It's so amazing seeing how they'll some some of those obviously like completely original creations, some people taking tools that we've released and just making them their own, doing things that we can never we never imagined. Oh my gosh. Like all this time in we're still being like amazed each and every week by yeah. all of you incredible clever clogs. Honestly, clever clogs. Clever clogs. Incredible stuff. Like we've we've had so many great moments with so many of the things we just saw there. Yeah. Um but there can only be one winner. And still having great moments in in like in I've forgotten what I was going to say. <laughs> go on, Jen. <laughs> you started it out. Yeah. Shutter's like, yeah, let's go. Wonderful stuff. Right, well, let's see what the community had to say about our winner for Innovation in Create. We have a couple of comments. They said, this creation really shows how anything is possible in Dreams, which is why I just love creating on such an innovative platform. Oh. And the second comment is, literally broke boundaries, which is pretty, pretty huge. Yes. So, Tom, please announce our winner. Our winner for innovation in create is the dreams picture importer by coinm you will need to do this for every single part of the time there's a limit to how many pixels can actually be merged into a single painting so i believe that's around 2500 pixels to add more pixels to the picture you're just gonna have to repeat this process at the end you should have your own permanent picture fully imported into dreams so Congratulations, Coinem. My gosh, when we saw that happening, so many of our molecules were like proper what? mind blown moment yeah. at the ingenuity of that. Cong congratulations, incredibly well deserved award. And thank you so much to our community for voting on that award mm. and choosing your winner. Talking of picture importers. Oh, yes. What are the functions? Do we think? Literally a picture importer, right? Do you think we right? can yeah. import a show picture? Off? Can you show them? Oh. Oh, here, here comes something. What's that? What, what is, is that? that? What is oh. that? Oh no! I'm, I'm no, not, no, no! I'm not, I'm not sure. We that were... is from 
their personal collection. Yeah, okay, yeah, let's just so play, we, play you know, that way. You're good. We're, we're live, okay. All right, okay. Um, so, uh, oh, getting something in my earpiece from our, our friends over at the Nomination Network. Oh, I, this... I, I believe we might have some footage coming in, some concerning This footage. doesn't sound very good. My goodness, what's happening? This is the voice of the chairman. Our final faces have been captured. All evil minions report to the laboratory. <laughs> the people of the nominations have grown restless. With no kaiju seen in over 30 years, they think it's safe to return to the ocean. Of course, this would doom Nomcom's Kelstone mining operation, and I can't allow that to happen. So, I have decided to resurrect the Macrograd! <laughs> Mr. Cube, I think you have something that belongs to me. Oh. Scope into the subject using L1 and X. Now, press and hold R2 to grab and remove the logic microchip. Excellent! Soon the mecha craft will be complete, and the people of the nominations will fear the kaiju once again. <laughs> you imbeciles! This character is just an NPC! We need advanced controller logic to power the mecha grab. Bring out the mecha penguin! Oh no. Oh no. What is going on, Jen? I don't know, but I'm very concerned. Nice. Shutter's very concerned. Shutter, are you okay? I feel like we've been betrayed by non okay, a little Shutter? bit. I'm starting to get very concerned. Like maybe just cover your eyes. Like yeah. don't don't look at what's happening. Yeah. My yeah. Oh. goodness, what are we gonna do? I, I don't thought, know. I thought we were safe in here and now yeah, I'm starting, LEDs there too. Now I'm starting to think our corporate overlords maybe aren't so friendly and trustworthy. Yeah, let's lock the doors. Maybe Let's lock the doors and get a... Yeah, oh my goodness. Okay. Um, well, we'll carry on with the award show in this totally normal environment. Uh, yeah, yes. yeah, yeah, everything's fine. Everything's fine. Um, what's the next category, Tom? Our next category is the evolving experience okay. category, which is recognising those uh, creators that have uh, spent the last 12 months uh, literally evolving their, their creations in dreams, yeah. whether that's a game, an interactive piece of media, uh, just really improving on it, whether it's introducing new elements, new features, working back and iterating, um, really spending the, the year creating something really special. Yeah, super exciting, super dedicated group of creat creators. Um, let's check out some of the nominees for Evolving Experience. This place just keeps going. The process and about 52 miles mapped out at the other gates. Amazing, amazing creations that uh, obviously resemble what they were at day one, but have become so much more. Yeah, so much growth in yeah. all those nominees. Mm. I, it's been a joy to see how they've come along over the past 12 months. Yeah. And of course, our winner voted for by you, the lovely community. Wonderful. Got my blurb, got my card. Go for it. Our winner for Evolving Experience is a creation that has truly captured the essence of this category, mm. providing us with an experience in dreams that's continued to grow over the last 12 months while introducing improvements to previous iterations as they go. Mm. Wonderful stuff. Right, let's reveal our winner for Evolving Experience. The winner of the MP is Trips Voyage by Euphilace, Avox 23, and Actual Jimmy Jam.
Congratulations, Thanks. folks. Congratulations, congratulations. And thank you once again to our amazing bunch of community that voted and nominated for that category. Amazing stuff. Oh, my goodness. Another huge category coming up. I believe we're getting close to the end of the evening now. How are we all feeling? How are we there already? Oh, I know. It's gone so Flown fast. by. I'm loving spending, you know, time with you and Shut. Yeah. It's super fun. I'm enjoying myself. Star of the show, may I say. Oh, oh I'm, may I, I mean, say. Star I think of the chat show. is already loving, yeah. loving our, our little friend over yes. here. My goodness. Okay. Well, the next category, a really, really special one. So special, in fact, that we've got 10 Ten of them. I believe. Ten of you. Uh, it is Community Star, which is a category that's dedicated to all of the people in the Dream of Us who've uh, made an impact on the community um, and really means something to the community as a whole. You know, supportive people, people who are helping out with things, people who are creating things that make the Dream of Us a wonderful place to be, that are including people, that are representing dreams with all the passion and enthusiasm they can muster. True, true stars of the Dream of Us. And these dreamers, they, they wear many hats from... Fezzes yep. uh, to 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 Connie cones. I mean, well, we, we didn't bring the hat back this no, year, no. just in case it caused more chaos. No. <laughs> My goodness, it's been quite the year. Um, but so many, so many hats, so many talents. My goodness, we love you all. Um, and yeah, what what a group of nominees. Uh, mm. It's been a delight to to read all these wonderful names. Let's check out the nominees for Community Star. Just change the color. Bam. And we have an enemy. And just like that, all of the enemies are red, all of the NPCs are blue. Au même instant, non loin de là, à une demi-lieu très exactement, un énorme loup rodé autour d'une maisonnette. Appearance. Now this next part is where it would be really great if I had my rabbit here. Okay, let's set up for scene one in the forest. Let's get some lights on. No, no, ugh, not me, Chad. Oops, uh, sorry. <laughs> I just gotta make my way down and I can... No! Solus, hang on! The top 10 of our favorite games and creations from the last week of PlayStation streams on PS4 and PS5. As always, the list is in no particular order. Ladies and gentlemen. Oh, Warms me up. What a lovely bunch. My goodness. Hello to everybody. Hopefully some of you watching at home. Yes. My goodness. Congratulations on all, to all the nominees. Absolutely amazing achievement. You've clearly, clearly won the hearts of the dreamers out there in the dreamers. So again, this was a community voter category. Um, and we have some comments from our lovely community members on our winner. They said, this, this winner helps drive the best of the Dreams community to show off their talent, all while showing what Dreamers are capable of to a wider audience. They're constantly supporting and championing not just the Dreams community, but also Dreams itself, and a positive and encouraging pillar of the community. Wow, amazing words. So our winner for the MP for Community Star is... Ugly Sofa Gaming! As always, the list is in no particular order. Make sure to watch until the end and let us know in the comments which was your favourite. Amazing work from Ugly Sofa Gaming. Congratulations, Congrats. folks. 
Congratulations, and thank you to everyone that voted on that category. I believe our last community voted category. Yes. Well yes. done, everyone. Again, great job turning out to vote, and thank you again for writing such lovely comments. Like we had so many lovely comments, not just about winners, but like other nominees. Yeah. And it was honestly so nice to read them all and read your words about how much you appreciated some of your fellow dreamers. Uh, yeah, wonderful. Thank you for that. Right. Well, I believe we have our last molecule drop in, and all our molecules are very, very special. But this is a molecule who's very very close to our heart. Take it away, Abby. Hey Dreamers, Abby here. Um, I wanted to send a shout out to some of my favorite horror creations in Dreams this year and to all the horror creators out there. I know when we put together a show like The Impies, uh, it's sometimes a little bit difficult to include the genre because it's all about pushing people's boundaries and comfort levels and yeah, it has. So <laughs> uh, big congrats to the backrooms. It was one of my favorite experiences in Dreams this year. I love playing along week to week. Uh, and also to Liminal, which was uh, just honestly delightful to see people on the team react to. Um, thanks so much and keep making wonderfully scary things. Thank you very much, Abby. She is here. She is here. We're just Whatever. embarrassing her. There you go. She said hi. <laughs> just embarrassing her by saying nice things about her. My goodness. <laughs> Wonderful stuff. Right. Oh, my gosh. We're down to our last two categories. I, I honestly don't know where the time's gone. I, it's gone so quickly, hasn't it? It's all good. All good. But <gasps> last two categories. So we obviously want to take some time and recoup, relax. And maybe, Shutter, do you want to recharge? Recharge. Recharge. I recharge. Get yourself yeah. sorted. Get yourself sorted. Oh. Oh. Very nice. There we go. Wonderful. Nice. Do you, do you think ready? they can, they know if, are they? No, no I don't. No, they're, they're out of the I think, yeah. yeah, we'll yeah. wake them up. We'll wake them up bit. in a bit. And then anyway, my goodness. Right. So. Our first of the two, last two categories is the Creator or Team of the Year Award, recognizing the superstars of the, dream, of the dream of us, who've created something really special, whether that's one thing or a whole load of things, or championed every other creator. Um, and it's an incredibly strong list. Yeah, my goodness, we have so many incredibly talented creators in the Dreamiverse. Again, this is a this is a tenor. A tenor. We've got ten people nominated for this award, or ten teams as well. Um, absolutely incredible stuff. All of you, super super deserving to be in this illustrious category. Uh, and yeah, amazing stuff. Let's take a look at the nominees for Creator or Team of the Year. <laughs> I've been waiting for this day for a thousand years. un énorme loup rodé autour d'une maisonnette. Motivé par la faim, la bête frappa et une vieille dame ouvrit. Wow! Wow! I'm almost there, Salas. There's a power radiating from inside. Ah! Gotta make my way down and I can. No! Solace! Hang on! If you 
wanna be a robot You got a bullet in the world Shed your flesh and bones and then I read it alone Cause you're a robot now And we will work it Yeah, you're a robot now It's not a me This goddamn thing's killed every animal I had. I used to have a head of 30 roosters, and I had about six or seven cats go missing. Brashley over there, he used to have a pet possum, but wait, wait, let's not bring that up, please. Listen, next spring we can get you another one. Wow, what a treat. Amazing To list. see that lot. My oh, goodness. Fuck. Shutter, how are you doing? Are you feeling sufficiently good. charged, rejuvenated? Recharged, rejuvenated. All good. Yes, look, the bow tie swinging again. <laughs> Wonderful. Wonderful. That's a, that's a sign of a healthy robot. Yes. Wonderful stuff. Right, well, creator or team of the year. Incredible. A, a panel judged category, indeed. But actually, Tom, we had some members of the community who were so passionate about the winner. Uh, that we received some community comments about them that I'd actually like to read before we of announce course, the winner. Of course, of course. Um, so their persistence to work on their creation, to always keep improving, really makes them such a deserving creator to win this award. We also had it might be weird to nominate creator of the year for only one creation, but the way this creator kept updating their creation has been incredibly inspiring. They truly showed what's possible in dreams if you really commit to it. Uh, and the last comment we had was on another level, incredibly detailed, open and honest about their development process. Who's the winner, Tom? Our winner of creator or team of the year is... Euphalace! <laughs> Wow, congratulations, Euphalace. Incredible. Huge and incredibly deserved win. Yeah, amazing. What a night for you. And thank you so much to our panel of judges for this category, including special guest judge Holly Bennett from Frontier. Shout out, Holly. And the Lost in Cult team. Oh, huge, the team huge love for them. behind, of course, the Lock On magazine that Dreams was on the cover of Gorgeous. last year. Fantastic stuff, featuring so many community creations. Oh, it was absolutely jaw-dropping. It was amazing to see. Absolutely in love with it. Thank you so much for coming along and helping judge the creator or team of the year category. All right. Um, I am, oh. I'm hearing something now. Are you? We're getting some live footage. What's going on? Right outside, right from outside nominations. Oh my gosh. Let's oh tune my goodness. in. Let's go find out. Are they, are they going to be okay? I, I think so. I'm hoping so. I mean, hopefully they're so, not... So chaotic, Jen. <laughs> I really thought 
you know, everything was going to go without a hitch. But, I mean, there's always some form of chaos in yeah. the 80s, it feels like. If one year it's ruckus, ruining your ceiling, <sighs> and it's an evil sentient company, whatever's going on out there, I don't, I just know, don't know what's know. going on, but I'm feeling very unsafe. Uh, let's let's make it through. We are on our last category oh of my the goodness. night. Oh, uh, my goodness. Oh, my goodness. So hopefully we can make a swift exit. Um, this is a very, very illustrious category. Uh, it is, of course, creation of the year, which is uh, a category that celebrates the very best creations in dreams of the entire year. We've got 10 nominees because the level of quality this year has been by far and away, just like... The list was the longest we've had oh, of, all, of all the MPs. It's incredible. It was so tough yeah. to even shortlist. Year on year, my yeah. goodness, the progress that like all of the creators have made in Dreams has been incredible to watch. Um, and we just love celebrating the yeah. absolute best of the best in the dream of us. Uh, we're so excited to show you this reel. Um, before we do, though, I suppose we should probably say thank you. Yes, Shutter, <laughs> Shutter, just... For Shutter, for carrying, for carrying the show. Incredible, incredible <laughs> yeah. work. You are just... There you go. Fantastic. Soak it up. Soak it up. Soak Absolutely it up. Fantastic. Yuck it We've up. We've barely had to do anything. Honestly, it's no. great. We should just yeah. automate the whole thing, yeah, you know, yeah. get the robot to do it. <laughs> it's wonderful. Yeah. Work. Oh, we'll get the eyebrow going. Yeah. Wonderful stuff. Amazing. Get a little thank you in there uh, before we carry on uh, to see our nominees for creation of the year. Here they are. Oh my goodness. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. I'm sure. Okay, well, they've made I'm a break. I'm sure everything is fine out there. I'm sure everything is fine. Shutter, you're okay? 
Uh, it's, it was Connie again, though, so I think Shutter's more than okay. Well, yeah, I think, I think, I think we know how Shutter feels. <laughs> okay, my sure, goodness. Sure, everything uh, is fine. Everything is again, fine. Again, security has gone to pot. My yes. goodness. Uh, never mind. Uh, right, uh, the judges' comments. Yes, off to that incredible, creation, incredible yeah. list of creations. Just absolutely... So good. Um, just unstoppable, <laughs> unstoppable. All ten of our nominees... Ooh, I'm going to start again. <laughs> okay. I'm going to start again. All 10 of our nominees in this category speak to a different strength of dreams, which made this a very tough one to call. Our judges, our goodness me. You can tell it's getting to the end of the show. Yeah, we, we I can do a, this. We need a little plug I can to do come this. down. Yeah, yeah. yeah I, need to, I need to recharge, <laughs> shut up. Our judges were, as with every year, taken aback by the breadth of what dreams has to offer. When deciding a winner, however, the lovely folks at Kinda Funny went with the nominee that shows multiple different best-in-class moments and provides dreamers with a truly unforgettable experience. My goodness. Let's find out our winner for creation of the year. Drum roll. The MP goes to... Trips Voyage by Euphalace, Avox23 and Actual Jimmy Jam! Whoa! Amazing, just I love it. I incredible, love it. Oh, incredible, incredible, incredible. Off. Just so much love for that <laughs> game throughout the last 12 months. My goodness, yes. Huge win. Isn't it deserved? Wow. Yes. Wow, wow, wow. Congratulations, Euphalace and Trips Voyage folks. Just amazing. One more round of applause. Yeah. So deserved. Yeah. <laughs> and a huge thank you to Janet Garcia and Blessing Adoye Jr. from Kinda Funny for helping us judge that category. Yes amazing again long time friends of the show yes. we really appreciate your help my goodness well uh oh hang on actually i think uh nomination network news uh might have a live broadcast uh we can we can flip to let's let's check it out reporting live from the shadow of mount dentkins where a suspected kaiju attack is underway Eyewitness reports indicate that a giant crab is at the centre of the explosion. If confirmed, this would be the first kaiju attack from the nominations in over 30 years. We are now joined by an eyewitness to the attack. A truly remarkable development. Please tell us more about how you managed to escape. <laughs> Thank you, Mega Penguin. For now, it seems that the nominations are safe. Now back to your regular scheduled program. Okay. Oh my goodness! <laughs> a little bit of a relief, although yeah. Mega Penguin looks a little bit lost. Yeah, I, I, at least at least he's safe. He, yeah, I, yeah. I'm I'm quite relieved. So Shutter, uh, great job as well at sort of explaining what was going on there, Mega Penguin. Yeah. Oh. Mega Penguin, some mega exposition. It's incredible, <laughs> incredible. And found the found the fleet and just oh, oh what a, what, what, a what moment! An what a moment! Oh, my goodness, incredible stuff. Well, now that we know that the situation in the nominations is cool, I think we should just sort of, you know, wrap up. Yeah, this show. My brings goodness. close the fourth annual Impy Awards. In style. Incredible, Let's, incredible. Here's hoping we'll do our best. Yes. My goodness, it has been a wonderful, wonderful evening. Thank you so much for joining us, for coming here and watching, saying hello to Shutter, hanging out in the chat uh, and applauding all of our amazing, amazing nominees and Winners. Uh, One more round of applause for our yeah, amazing winners. Yeah, why not? Why not? <laughs> <laughs> Wonderful stuff. But before we leave you, we've got to say some some thanks 
to yes. a bunch of people that helped make all this happen. My goodness. First, a big, big shout out to our judges, not only from Across Media Molecule, but our very, very special guest judges who've come from all sorts of industries, come uh, and play dreams and, uh, you know, look at all the amazing stuff our dreamers have been doing uh, and help judge the categories. Uh, we've had so many amazing, amazing friends turn out and offer their time to help us. We really, really appreciate you. Thank you so much. Hopefully some of you uh, watching this um, and if so, you know who you are. Thank you so much. Um, good stuff. We've been, we've been name dropping some names oh, throughout have. the show. We I have. think we have. Yeah. Yeah. And a huge thank you to everyone at Media Molecule, especially the people behind the camera at the studio that have helped us put together this amazing show. <laughs> a round of applause for everyone working on the show. And this event has been absolutely incredible. What a show. Absolutely incredible. Making our, it very easy for us to do. Our tech folks keep making it all look amazing and sound amazing and just, just incredible, incredible work. Fantastic. So much love goes into it and it is it has been honestly such a joy. We've all really, really enjoyed yeah. putting this all together for you, haven't we, Shutter? My goodness. Thank you to Shutter again. We've already kind of given you your moment, but yeah, you know, you know, I mean, what can you do about the robot? My goodness. Yeah. Uh, incredible <laughs> stuff. And of course, another great, great, great. Great, 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 great. great Thank great, you great, and great. a shout out to everyone in the Dreams community for voting on our community voted categories. We did a stellar job this year. My goodness. And just thank you for, for making things in Dreams. Thank yeah. you for, for sh turning out to this and, and watching us do our thing. My goodness, we do it all for you and we absolutely love it. It is an honor and a privilege and a pleasure. It's so much fun. The highlight of the year, honestly. So good. It's <laughs> all about celebrating you, whether you're a nominee or a winner or just simply take part in Dreams, whether it's inside the game, outside the game. Interact with us on social media, on our streams, wherever, whenever, when if we meet, met you in real life at shows or whatever, thank you so, so much. Hope you feel celebrated. I, I, I personally think we've done a very, a very nice job. <laughs> so I hope you I hope you are feeling the love I really that is what the MPs has always been about from day one so and this is the ultimate ultimate testament to that, how fantastic you are whether you whether you play create share or just spend time with us in dreams it's our absolute honor and our pleasure not just mine and Jen's everyone here and then to be here for you guys <laughs> so thank you so so much Yes, it has been amazing. We've super, super enjoyed this year's show. We hope you have too. But now it's it's time for us to go off to the off to the club, I think, and explore a little bit of what's going on in the nominations. Maybe there's some after parties happening. Shutter, are you ready to kind of to I don't know, get down, you know? You ready? You've you got some moves, so you're like, oh no, you're not ready hey, to look, get you down. Can tap dance. You can tap dance. They can they shake see? their head. Did Wait. They, did they say no? <laughs> you said no! <laughs> Proud. Oh my gosh. Okay, quick. Ask oh. some no questions. Um, um, uh, do you uh, want the impies to to? Do you want the show to 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 be over? Because we don't. Oh my gosh. No. 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 Oh, oh no. <laughs> do, do you like do you like nomcom? No. 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 Oh. no, no. <laughs> Shut up. No. They're evil. No, we've program, we've talked back about to this. The programming. Oh my <laughs> goodness. I mean, it. You know, it takes a it takes a it takes a while to deprogram a robot. We'll give it our best shot. But yeah, I think the first thing we can do is take them out for a bit yeah. of, a bit of dancing. Yeah. Let's do that. And uh, before we before we leave you, we have something very very special that we're gonna cue into uh, from a, a little impy winning someone called Venwave. Thank you so much, Venwave, for making the amazing amazing piece of music we are about to hear um we love you thank you so much we're so excited we have this and we're very excited for everybody to hear it and with that all that's left to say is roll credits roll credits last but not least hello hello hello, hello. 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 audio design thank you community thank you thank you to the dreams oh yeah thank you you community. Oh, 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 oh. Thank you. Ready? Community. It's the dreams. You. Thank you to the dreams. Oh yeah. Community. Okay. It's the dreams. You. Thank you to the dreams. Yes. next.
the louder. Thank you.